My name is Ilkan Usta. I am here to give a presentation about uh, our new electric course for uh, 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 wood culture that we designed uh, in 2012 uh, to uh, undergraduate students in our university. Uh, as a time limitation, uh, I just uh, go to the introduction of this course uh, to show without these images. Uh, wood, uh, as wood is the universal material uh, that is used uh, from the ancient times based on its anatomical structure, chemical components, physical and mechanical properties. Uh, wood is an indispensable passion for us in the case of complementary material of organic lifestyle. This is coming forward today with a worldwide uh, view. Uh, now there is a substantial natural material. It's time to introduce wood to the society. At this point, a new elective course named as Importance of Wood in Intercultural Interaction was designed to introduce for all undergraduate students of Hajit University. Uh, within the framework of the curriculum of the Department of Wood Products Industrial Engineering, which has been updated within the scope of Bologna uh, process. The importance of wood in intercultural interaction, uh, designed by a wood lower viewpoint for the first time in our country, is aimed to sample the role of wood in intercultural interaction through informing students about the role and importance of wood in intercultural interaction and introducing its phenomenal construction in various cultures through descriptions in order to raise awareness about wood, a natural material. The implications forming a basis for these depictions are internalized with professional and technical knowledge, and in these uh, de depictions that are made with a wood lower approach, certain theoretical explanations to the strength in wood awareness and general depictions to introduce wood, considered as an exquisite natu natural material in intercultural interaction are made. Uh, this is uh, an elective course for undergraduate students uh, and uh, it's open to all students rather than uh, the uh, fields of wood. Uh, it's uh, just uh, two hours uh, lectures within one week. We uh, actually attempt to open this course for one, uh, fall semesters, but uh, uh, according to the uh, demands of the citizens, uh, we now open this uh, course in both terms, in either fall and spring terms. Uh, the capacity of the uh, course is 25 uh, due to our facilities. Uh, we show uh, some uh, images, pictures and movies uh, regarding the wood, wood materials uh, and some kind of uh, applications. Uh, uh, from starting uh, past to, 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 to today and also uh, future aspects. Uh, course objective uh, to provide uh, information about to the importance of wood in cross-cultural interaction within the scope of the concept of intercultural interaction. To illustrate the role of wood in intercultural interaction according to descriptions of wood in different cultures by introducing various cultures of wood from of actual constructions. There are outcomes uh, comprehend uh, by the end of this lesson. Students will be able to comprehend the global motion of the indigenous figure of the national culture, aware about the importance of wood in the concept of culture, gain knowledge about the historical development of process of treating wood material, compare the effect of wood used in the process of interaction in the context of form of intercultural interaction. Uh, there are uh, course content according to Bologna process as well. Uh, to the concept of national culture and intercultural interaction, the importance of intercultural interaction of wood, evolution of wood as a universal symbol, similarities of wooden figure of a specific culture in the perception of another culture, and a different form of perception thanks to others, the impressiveness, concrete and abstract performance of wood within the framework of influence of other cultures and writing elements, the technological framework of the universality of wood. Uh, these are the uh, course topics. Uh, we have 14 weeks. One week is for midterm exam. 
uh, we start to give some uh, information about wood as a material and then show some applications using wood uh, in our daily lives. Uh, this is a methodology of assessment. Uh, participation is, uh, is ob obliged uh, to attendance. 10% uh, homework, 20% project, 30% midterm, and 40% is final exam uh, to pass students. Uh, this is a way of uh, project. Uh, we, we, we have given uh, a project in these titles, for instance, one of these titles we are giving as a project uh, to prepare 20 or 20, 30, between 20 and 30 slides and to show the class at the end of the term. Uh, it, like introduce the universality of using some images, explain the acceptation and internalization of food as a valuable object, define why wood is the most important tool in, the, in intercultural interaction, introduce any goods or equipment or application with made of wood, describe how wood has a role in the development of civilization, indicate what's the attractiveness of wood. These are just the sample of uh, the uh, topics uh, for projects and we have given this uh, project as a group. And also there is a homework, uh, a kind of uh, homework titles is these are. Uh, we have given this, uh, these topics to the students individually and uh, asked to write or compose uh, a text uh, at least 30, 300 words about how would you define that you are the one like wood, for instance, According to you, such applications, handle ice cream, bread cutting board, cooking spoon, cook exemplary of the universality of food. And what is meant by the following phrase? Is there anything like it? So such uh, topics uh, are just examples. And we have given more of, more of uh, uh, than these topics as well. These uh, are the uh, uh, abstract of uh, the attempt uh, by students to this course. We started to give this uh, course in spring uh, 2013. Uh, there are 16, uh, 11 are uh, female students. Uh, in uh, 2014, spring, there are 20. Uh, in summer school, uh, students asked to uh, open this uh, course within summer school and the number of uh, students is 87, so it's uh, quite a lot of uh, students' uh, attendances. Uh, this year, uh, in the fall semesters, there are 25, uh, also in uh, spring semester, 25, and still uh, continue. So uh, these are the numbers of students that choose in this uh, course. Uh, numbers shows the uh, number of students and these are departments, uh, fields of students coming from to uh, select this course. Uh, have a look at these uh, fields. Uh, there are so many different fields uh, choose this uh, course. Uh, the students uh, looking to uh, find out uh, what is wood, uh, what is the importance of wood in our field. So have a look at this uh, com uh, from computer engineering, American culture and literature, classroom teaching, sports sciences, audiology, you see, uh, industrial engineering, chemistry, so etc. So there are so many uh, different uh, fields rather than wood science. Uh, just a few images I would like to uh, talk to you, I would like to show you about what we show the students to get some uh, interaction. Uh, so this, this figure uh, is the uh, most uh, uh, fine uh, images uh, on wood carving, so like snails, like forms of snails. Uh, and uh, we may see this, this shape, this form, in many kinds of uh, uh, wood carving in different uh, cultures, uh, from one nation to another, for instance. So uh, you may see this snail form. So it's a kind of uh, golden proportion, so which is the uh, performance of aesthetic appearances. So 
if you if you look at these um, applications, for instance, uh, we may uh, see this figure as well because uh, anesthetic appearances. If you come over to this uh, application, for instance, uh, he try to create this kind of aesthetic uh, aesthetical uh, appearances. Uh, this this cinema form, for instance, have a look at this. This is more appreciated than aesthetical appearances to get uh, people like to see it, like in here. Okay? So that is the same figure on this wood carving application, and that's the same figure on this violin, violin uh, uh, branch, for instance. So it, it is just the way of understanding the uh, wood culture, understanding the interaction uh, of wood culture. So this, this is just one example of uh, the role of wood in intercultural interaction. So, etc. We can continue with this, for instance. This is uh, Winsor Vince Chairs, for instance. You may see this figure as well. Okay? It is like we can see here, like we can see here. So all, all these are the same figure that we may see. So uh, this is just one example to show the importance of food in intercultural interaction. Uh, and also some kind of other applications like this tone uh, food on, on this uh, chair, like that. So uh, unfortunately, I have no time uh, to give more uh, speech about these images. Uh, wood is come up to the uh, organic lifestyle uh, and it is important uh, in our life. At the end of this class, uh, we would like to uh, hear from the students that I love wood because I'm one of the lovers. And uh, we, we, can, we can already see that uh, all students after uh, the course, they are so happy to see wood, to understand wood, uh, and to uh, uh, for awareness about wood in our daily life. So thank you very much uh, to give this opportunity.